What up gamers, Fence here here, and welcome back to Fallout 76. So last episode we finished up the Wayward Souls quest line and yeah, you know, did all their stuff, you know, helped out Duchess and her crew, finish all that. And uh yeah, she told us that there was a radio that was um yeah, about the overseer. I listened to that. I think I just heard some gunshots, yeah, I'm hearing it over there. <laughs> just uh, logged into another private adventure. Yeah, not called uh, Private Worlds anymore. They're now uh, Private Adventure. I guess just so it doesn't like sound conflicting with the custom worlds. Because, yeah, there's all it can also be private in a way. But yeah, um, here we are at the Overseer's place. Because the radio um, it told us to go here. And, ooh, wow, she already got like a whole bunch of stuff here. Okay, some ammo. She got us Tinkerer's Workbench, which I might use. And right, do need to um start managing my inventory well. Yeah, I really need to. Okay, uh, let me go and scrap some items here. There we go. And yeah, we do need to store some stuff as well. Because I, I really want to work on my inventory. Like, ooh, should probably yeah store some of this stuff. Wow! Stack weight of... Three. This one's 14. I think we can just store the supers, right? Yeah. We can store the supers. Uh, we can keep maybe... Yeah, just maybe... Uh, let's go all the way over here. We can keep five, and then we can also just keep five here. Um, Yeah, how many would that be? Would be nine. There we go, I did my math right. <laughs> We got some stealth boys. I don't really plan to use stealth boys anytime soon. Maybe when I really, really need it. But yeah, I really need to start getting things down so that I can collect stuff again. Yeah, I really want to collect stuff. The healing salve. I got a bunch of those. I'm going to put them in there. Even the blood packs. Ooh, better sell these at some point. Oh my gosh, and I got a bunch of these stuff too. Well, um, I am... I think that's okay for now. Um, I do want to start um, upgrading my weapons too. Mainly that new legendary one that we got. Uh, where's the weapons workbench? We do need to make some... We do need to make some stuff. Some more ammo. Um, yeah, just normal ammo. Need to make some 44s. Uh, can only go up to 6. We'll just make 3 then. Probably not going to be too much. But, yeah, I just really want myself... Oh, right. Let me also open myself up a lunchbox. It's going to be an aid. Uh, here it is. Hooray! We got finger trap. We got that before, right? Yeah, I believe we, we got that before. Um, damage for super mutants and ghouls. We both. Really, I can do more damage. Wow, that's pretty awesome. Alright, but yeah, we got our um, legendary two-shot bashing uh, 44 Magnum here, our 44 pistol. Yeah, can't wait to be using this a lot in battle. Um, oh, wait, here's here's the weapon bench. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm really hoping... Oh, wait, we, well, we can't... Oh, we can modify. Press R to modify. Now, yeah, one thing that, I, that um, is kind of disappointing is that I'm not sure if we're able to upgrade, like, our level here. Like, um, you know, turn this into, like, a, maybe, like, a level 10, uh, 44 pistol and all that. So, yeah, that's gonna be something that really sucks. I'm not sure if that's, like, a thing that we, we can do. But, yeah, we can, like, upgrade some stuff. We can get the long barrel, which I do want because it kind of... I don't like it being snub nose. Kind of looks weird to me in general. <laughs> Ooh, we can put on a um a reflex sight. Okay. And then yeah, if we have any skins we can put it on, but I don't have it. There we go. Alright. So yeah we do got ourselves a new sight here. Ooh yeah things are looking pretty much up. Anyways, I do want to go inside uh just right away. Is there any beds? Any like beds that um are not underground. 
Um, yeah, here's her back door. Oh, we can enter from the back. Ooh, there's a fusion core. I'm guessing that's that powers her house. I feel like that would mean that would need to be guarded more. But yeah, I don't think she has any beds outside. Um, yeah, I don't think so. She got a cooking station, but no sleeping mattress, which I think I do want to get more XP. But yeah, not here. Wait, is this another door? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I didn't see that. Ooh, nice. Yeah, a lot of a lot of good stuff. Okay. Yep. I've been uh, stalling a bit too long now. I want to go inside and meet the overseer. Oh, thank oh boy. God you're here. I almost. It's just so good to see you. Let's talk. Downstairs. Dang. Okay. Cozy What's with the walking? Is, there's <laughs> someone I'd like you to meet. Okay. We really went overboard with this place. Feel free to look around. But yeah, here's the overseer, man. This is really exciting. Look at her armor too. She looks like a badass. She's seen some things. Going down. Wait, okay, really nice to meet you, overseer. You know, I remember you from the the base vanilla game. You were like never really seen a lot. Only through voice, and now we get to meet you in person, which, you know, feels like one of those, like, those myths or legends. You know how, like, you know, in Star Wars, like, um, you know, everyone, they would question about, like, Luke Skywalker's, like, legitimacy. And then that, you know, when they actually meet him, like, he's actually a thing. Whoa, he's a Jedi. <laughs> well, yeah. That's just how we see the Overseer. It's really awesome just to see her in person. Let me introduce but... you to Davenport. What's up? He's been helping me with some reconnaissance. Keeping an eye on Appalachia. Oh, so good to meet you. The you. Overseer has been so excited to see everyone again. Once you've acquainted yourself with our new arrivals, I may have some field work for you. I couldn't have pulled this place off without him. Let's talk. Okay. Yeah, Overseer, what's up? I know you have questions, and we'll get to them. I have an important mission. <laughs> but you're just not ready. It's too dangerous. I can't in good conscience send you on it. You need to get better gear, and sadly, better real-world training than we provided in the vault. Go to Flatwoods. The responders had a volunteer program that I know I found helpful. Okay. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Wait, look at her, man. She's got those um, the spike pauldrons, that leather arm. Yeah, that's really cool. But, yeah, I had some questions about the overseer logs you left behind. All right. Go ahead. Uh, I'm still looking for all of them. Well, remember, it's not a scavenger hunt. I put them in place to help you on your way, even when I can't be there personally. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, after the vault opened, you disappeared. Where were you all this time? Yeah, really curious, because, you know, I feel like we were always there in real time. Like, I guess communicating, but I never communicate back in the, you know, with the vanilla quests. But yeah, it's kind of weird how we just never meet up. Um... Pretty hypocritical for me, of all people, to take off on my own, huh? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> At first, I was just racing ahead, hoping that if there was any trouble, I'd hit it first. Mm. And then there were the nukes, the scorched plague, seeing my old neighborhood bombed to pieces. I, I needed time. Mm. I mean... <laughs> Um, I I don't think she's really for Vault Tech, but I'll just I'll just be neutral. You know, I'm just glad you're here now. Me too. Uh, why settle here in Sutton? I know this is your place. Um, I think if you do the main quest, like it takes you back here, at some point, maybe one of the side quests. But yeah, this is like her um childhood home. I grew up here. Yeah. My parents used to live just down the hill. If there's one neighborhood I'm rebuilding first, it's this one. Of course. Yeah, it makes sense. 
Uh, what's the deal with the volunteer program? I wish the responders had survived. They sound like courageous people. Sadly, all wiped out. But they automated some of their basic survival training. Just go to the church in Flatwoods, and their programs will take it from there. Okay. I just left Vault 76. Any advice? You just what? <laughs> Seriously? What were you doing in Vault 76 all these months? Ugh. All right. Everyone was supposed to leave at Reclamation Day. My advice? Start pulling your weight and catch up and maybe invest in an alarm clock. <laughs> okay, and uh, yeah, she doesn't want to talk to me anymore because of that. That's... You're you sure? Back. You're still not ready for the mission. Yeah, I know. I just want to see if there's anything else. Better gear and yeah, I know. Go to Flatwoods. Is there anything else? Um, is there anything else? Oh, I guess I can go now. Stay careful out there. Together we've made Appalachia safer. But she still has fangs. But yeah, I guess that does confir confirm, like, the timeline. Because, like, when, uh, yeah, this game first released, you know... There was no NPCs, there was no, um, you know, no Wastelanders, like the Wayward Souls, they were not there. But yeah, um, I guess this does confirm that, you know, now with anyone that's coming to this game, you know, the end game time will take place like one year, I think, in the future. Because I think that's when the Wastelanders were introduced, like after one year. So yeah, I was pretty much like... <laughs> One year, I think, in the vault, like, as a new player. But, you know, this is just me, like, you know, restarting. I just want to play through the whole game again. Because, um, yeah, I just want to do a Let's Play series of it. I should probably... Ooh, okay. Maybe, um, I hope you don't mind. You know, I'm going to try my best, like you said, to catch up. Gonna... <laughs> gonna take everything here. Hey, what about you, Davenport? The Overseer keeps me quite busy gathering information. All warned is forearmed, as they say. <laughs> cool. All right. Well, actually, before I leave, I do want to take a picture with you guys. Because, you know, this is a very monumentous... Did I even say that right? Monumentous moment. Because <laughs> we get to meet, meet up with the Overseer. So let me go ahead and do some snapping. Okay, so this was kind of hard to do because she never looks forward. So I had to, um... <laughs> Uh, make up for that and go like look to the right of her But yeah, we c couldn't um make her look in front of her yeah, It's always um Always uh <laughs> looking to this side like looking at Davenport's here, but yeah overseer. It's been nice seeing you here um, I'm going to maybe take some more stuff along the way so that I can scrap Because it's just uh, yeah, it's free free scrap. I hope I'm not like um you know, breaking anything, or like, you know, I just hope that these things respawn, like, yeah, respawn after a certain amount of time. That's one one thing I don't really like to do, like, when it comes to, like, other people's places, like, I just, you know, want to leave, the, leave it there for decoration, but, you know, I am actually just really hoping they respawn. <laughs> Ooh, I got some pie, too. Oh, I'm overcumbered. Uh, it doesn't matter, we'll scrap them and all that fun stuff. We got a broom here. Okay, I took some beer. Hey, yeah, none of this is considered stealing, by the way. Ooh, wait, reds? Oh, because I drink some water here. Yeah, very interesting. Cool. I believe I have stashed everything. Now I shall, uh... Oh, wait, no, she's got a place up here. Oh, another place to go out from. Undamaged American flag. Ooh. Okay, this must be a... Oh, this is her childhood area. Ooh, you can see, like, the military stuff. Ooh. Oh, that's really cool. Was she, like, a firefighter, too? Or, like... Dang, she's got, like, some careers going on over here. Like, I know there's, like, a diary or something. Hey, there's some syrup. Okay, cool. Um... An accordion. <laughs> Can we play with that? Yeah, Vault Tech University. 
Ooh. Oh, look, a weapon. Wooden ski. Can we make the ski sword with that? But yeah, uh, I guess I'll take it. I guess I'll scrap that too. Wait, there's another door here. Is this her bathroom? Wait, does she not have a bathroom? Imported Chinese panda. What well, makes it like a Chinese panda? I thought pandas were already Chinese, right? Isn't that like their origination or something? I don't know. Maybe it's just a make. And we can lockpick if you want. Alright. Yeah, I think we're good here. Um, We'll take that frame. <laughs> I think we're good. Let's go leave. Nice to meet you, um... Yeah, vault Tech lady. Yeah, some stuff I missed. Let's go. So right now, our current objective is to get to level 20. And she told, told us to go to Flatwoods to do that stuff. And I know that's going to be the start of us doing, like, the, the main quests. All that fun, fun stuff that we can do. Ooh. Hey, more ammo that I missed from before. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, let me go and scrap everything that I got the junk. Ooh, I need it. I need that, that stash box, too, maybe. Let's go in, uh... Yeah, scrap that. Don't need it. Got a medium scope. Um, yeah, I do need to, if I want to unlock more attachments for my gun here, probably need to, um, yeah, like, scrap some more, more stuff. Okay. Yeah, at some point, uh, we do need to place down a camp and just, yeah, put it in the stash box. We can play the banjo here. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. So... I guess with that, you know, since uh, we got to go to Flatwoods for this, I believe we got to go to Flatwoods. Um, yeah, first contact, I guess we should listen to that, but I want to, uh, yeah, go back to the, the camp over here. Yeah, my camp. And then I guess we'll rest up at the Overseer. Oh, no, wait, we got the motel, right? Yeah, we can do that. And there it is. I wonder if I can keep this or is this, will this disappear when I decide to leave? I don't know, but... Uh, let me scrap and store all my junk. Yeah, put it all in here. Oh, uh, what's with the cooking oil? Okay, there we go. Um, yeah, can I, like, dismantle this now? I don't think I really need this camp anymore. Because, um, we'll be going to Flatwoods. And that will take us on a, a big journey across the Appalachia. And I know she only said, you know, just do the Flatwoods. Just to get me started. But, um, you know, if it's anything like the main quest, it's going to take me all around. And I do hear some gunshots. There's an iBot. Are they destroying my camp? Hold on. I need to actually, uh, I need to see. Oh, yeah. Yes, it is. Did I see some? Okay. Yeah, there's just some rad stags up there. Yeah, there we go. Not sure what's the deal with this iBot. All right, has enough time passed now to see if uh, Polly has got her new body? I do want to check that out, but yeah, first I want to sleep, and then um, yeah, as I sleep, I do want to uh, listen to that hollow tape. Uh, what was it? Uh, listen to Overseer's Log Camp. Uh, what, what, what am I getting up, huh? You see this? The cooking station, the stash box, oh. the workbenches, <laughs> all built with the camp. Okay. You need a home base out there. The construction and assembly mobile platform is designed to give you one. Mm -hmm. Just add resources, planning, and a little elbow grease. When you move your camp, everything you've built is stored, ready to be placed back down in the new area. 
Use this to establish a foothold whenever you're in unfamiliar territory. I've left my camp behind so you can use it. I know I'm breaking my own advice by not taking it with me. But after seeing Appalachia for myself, I need to make sure every resident of 76 has a safe haven they can start from. I'll make do without it. That's going to be tough. If it's still standing, the town of Flatwoods is further down this road. Find me there. Find you there. The Signing off. So yeah, this is a, um, it's an old, this is an old, uh, recording because, yeah, it's taking place around like one year ago when she used to be traveling around and all that. But yeah, now I guess she's, uh, staying over there at Sutton. So that's cool. And yeah, we got her camp here. I guess, I don't know. I looked at like the conversation interrupted my sleep. <laughs> so yeah, I got to go back and rest up. Okay, cool. Also, hold on, I need to check on something. Um, <laughs> I need to check on my perks because I think I might have messed up. Uh, go here. What did I put for my... Ooh, that's bad. <laughs> I meant to only have one gladiator, I think. Yeah, I'm looking at my build right now. Oops, I put two. That's not good. I guess uh, we'll try to maybe fix it next time. But yeah, I meant to have like one gladiator, one expert. And one master. But yeah, I just forgot what I uh what I want. Uh but yeah, anyways, um <laughs> we'll deal with that next time. Anyways, let's go ahead and uh Whoa 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 Jide! My dude, how are you doing that? Okay. Yeah, before we leave here, I do want to check up on uh Polly. Oh boy, I just see her right there. What's up, Polly? Nice body. You you did real good, brother. <laughs> this body is nothing short of art. All the little malfunctions and mishaps I've been putting up with for years. Gone. I'm like a newborn babe. If babies could turn a human into a cadaver in under eight seconds. Here, I made you this from some parts oh. I didn't need anymore. As thanks. Now go get comfy. Um, I did. Uh, I just yeah, thought about it. You know, the way she said you, like it sounded kind of like mean. So if I did the protection body thing, then it would have uh, maybe gone to like a bad conversation. But yeah, I guess um, I guess we got the good ending or something. <laughs> hey there. Hey, Duchess. Uh, do you have any, actually any, any um, I guess no ammo around here. The wayward interrogation, that's my stuff. <laughs> All right. But yeah, let me see what she has. Only, um, she does have ammo, but not 44s, which is sad. Um, I guess I can, should I buy some purified water? Nah. What's up, Morty? What's up, soul? What's in here again? Oh, this is the bathroom. I never knew about this. Well, it's nice uh, seeing you guys again. What is Polly's old head, by the way? This a, uh, no, this is not a, it's not a weapon. Okay, uh, maybe if you go to new. What is this? Oh, it's a helmet. What? Wait, how do I need to see myself in? Oh shoot! Oh, we got the assaultron head. No way. But like, it doesn't. It's not animated. Uh. Oh wait, it is. Hold on. Put this back. Oh, there we go, dude. The assaultron head is like um you know one of my favorite helmets just because it does it has the animation so yeah if you're not holding a weapon it just opens up but then if you are it closes up like that um hoping that yeah there we go yeah, you see that it closes up like that i think that's so cool but yeah just i do like that a lot uh let me put my weapon away go back to first person and yeah, it's kind of pointless in first person because <laughs> you can't really see it. But, you know, it's just a feeling like, I don't know, it's just cool. Like if you want to have a conversation, you just open up your helmet. If you want to go into fighting, you know, you want to protect your face, you uh, yeah, pull out your gun. But yeah, I'm really happy. I'm pretty happy that, you know, I gave her that Assaultron body because now I got her helmet. Awesome. Okay, uh, anyways, we're going to Flatwoods. You know, 
nice to see you guys for like maybe a long while because I don't think there's going to be anything like more to do here. But yeah, it looks like it is under apparel, so it is a cosmetic. It's not like, um, yeah, it's not, it doesn't have any armor rating. So yeah, no defense on the head, but that's fine. I don't know what's up with Jide. He's, he's been acting weird lately, even the walking. Like even with the overseer, she's been, what she introduced with us. Oh, what's with that Brahmin though? I, I can tell. <laughs> uh, Alright, well, I'll see you guys later. I'll see you later, Bessie. It's time for me to finally move on. Um, Oh, we also got the Overseer. Wait, did we not do that? I thought we did, right? Did I not update my thing? What was this again? kind of forgot. Overseer's log. Or should I say direct... Well, yeah, I think I'll just um head over to Flatwoods. We'll, like, do stuff there. Oh, there's the Brotherhood. But I'm glad you did. Truth oh no, wait. I, I think I've already help. seen this. It's a good old Flatwoods, right? Log, south of yeah, I don't know why we're we need to listen to this again. It's a Brotherhood. Alright, we're going. He even got themselves a working light. That's pretty nifty and handy. All right, there's a uh, Mr. Farmhand once again. What's up, dude? Oh my gosh! There we go. The stash box, the workbenches, all built with the camp. Yep, the camp. You need a home base out there. The construction and assembly mobile platform is okay. Okay. Oh, hold on. Oh. to pay that anytime soon. Congratulations! Uh, thank you, Mr. Prizebot. Um, yeah, what's with that? A gas prize certificate. Congratulations, winner of the Great Appalachia Sweepstakes. We are pleased to inform you that you uh, have won the second prize. Dang, 100... like 100,000 US dollars. Allow between 16 and 52 weeks for uh, check delivery. Great Appalachia Soup Takes Incorporated is not responsible for any um, interest. Yeah, okay. I mean, <laughs> it's kind of worthless now. All I can use them for is like leather, I think. But yeah, we're getting close to Flatwoods, guys. The uh, uh, home of the, the green monster. Oh, is it because of the Flatwoods monster? <laughs> it's just about time to oh. Oh, yeah. I remember you. You were kind of selfish, right? What is this? A desk fan? Oh, who carries around a desk fan? I mean, I have. For uh, scrapping purposes. Okay, what, what? What was that? I mean, I'm guessing that's a mole rat. But why did it, like, go up like that? <laughs> I have no idea. I know it can be getting some mole rat meat. I just don't care for it right now. I just want to do some scrappings and all that. We got a newsstand. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay, there's it's a friendly opossum. Yeah, we've been pretty much. Yeah, we've been here before. Okay, that's uh, another mole rat with a weird. <laughs> a thing here. Okay, cool. Actually, I might need. To, do I need some meat to do that? Because once we get to Flatwoods, it's pretty much like tutorials. For like when you first play the game. You know, before the. Uh, ooh. We got a survivor story. 
Yeah, before the... What was it? Yeah, before the Wastelanders came in. Like, you would actually go here first. Into, uh, Flatwoods. Instead of, like, you know, potentially also doing the Wayward Souls. But no, you would just go straight here. After discovering that camp, you know, most likely you will uh, go here instead if you're a new player. But yeah, where should the responders though? I mean, these sound pretty neat. You know, I was hoping that with the, the Wastelander stuff, they would maybe try to repopulate some of these factions. I know in a way that they did, but kind of wish they did more. Alright, yeah, there's also this person too. You know, this is pretty much how far I gotten when I, you know, played this game, like, a little while back. But yeah, I got to meet her, and then I think I got to, um, like, do some parts of the quest, like, with the fire breathers. But, like, nothing really changed over there with the, with any updates. But hey there, Heather Ellis. Are you here for the responder training? Um, as a matter of fact, I am. Then you're not alone. A lot of people come here because of that radio message the responders left. That's what brought me here too. At first, I was planning to just do the training and move on, but honestly, I kind of like it here. I really enjoy meeting all the people that pass through and hearing their stories. Wait a minute. Are you one of those people who was in Vault 76? Yeah. Um, <laughs> I sure am. Or why do you ask? I keep hearing about it. I've even met some people who say they came from there. And honestly, I believe them. It's so interesting. People living underground for years, and then the doors open, and suddenly there's this whole new world to explore. So, did I guess right? Uh, yeah. I sure am. I knew it! I could tell just by looking at you. I've always thought that life in a vault must be so amazing. <laughs> With the robots and all the machines and having everything you need every day. Best of all, you're safe. Which, let me tell you, is a thing us outsiders very rarely get to feel. Though I guess you're one of us now, so that's all in the past for you. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm not that lucky compared to like other vaults. <laughs> I'm one of the lucky ones, but yeah, can you help me out? I could really use some supplies. Of course. I know how hard it can be out there. Uh, thank just you. just made up some stim packs. Here, you Ooh. can have these. Give yourself an injection when you're hurt and they'll heal you right up. Yeah, I just stored some. Um... Yeah, tell me about yourself. Me? There's not much to tell, really. I came in with Paige and the rest and stayed up at Foundation for a while. Paige? It was nice. But eventually I wanted to go my own way, you know? Get out and see some places I've never seen, figure out who I am. When I heard the message on the radio about Flatwoods, I was curious to meet the responder, so I made my way here. I decided to stay here and see what else I could learn. That's pretty much my story. Okay. So she was uh, also a Foundation settler. Tell me about Foundation. It's a community of settlers up in the mountains to the east. It's a nice enough place, I guess. That being said, it's a hell of a dangerous trip trying to get there. I barely made it out of the mountains alive. Ooh. If I were you, I'd keep to the forest until you're ready to deal with some seriously nasty stuff. Okay. I mean, they're, so they're up in the, in the mountains. That already gives me like a, um, a plus one to them. Because I do like, you know, if I'm going to have myself like a house or a settlement, I would love it to have a good view. And I imagine that it, they might have that. Um, I wonder what the uh, what the other faction, the raiders, would uh, bring out. But even though, yeah, I, I actually seen them, like, the raider settlement, though. And there's, look, there's also look really cool. What about Paige? He's the closest foundation has to a leader, I guess. Ooh. I never got to know him real well. But he always seemed like a decent guy. Honest, reliable, cares about the people, that kind of stuff. Okay. Um, there's something else I'd like to know. Okay, what is it? Uh, what do I like to know? Uh, what's with the responder outfit? I found it in one of the houses. It fits great, and it's really comfortable and pretty durable, too. I'd also be lying if I said it didn't have some sentimental value for me. I've admired the responders ever since I first heard about them. What they stood for, helping people no matter what. That was really important. Yeah, they're pretty much the Minutemen of this game. Anything interesting you, you can tell me about this area? Yeah, there's a couple of places around here that qualify as interesting. At least to me. The Agricultural Research Center is infested with feral ghouls and homicidal robots. 
But you can find some good scrap in there. The new river oh, gorge resort to the east Kinda is the skipped. same story. Maybe, minus the robots. Okay, thanks for your time. No problem. Alright, cool. Um, I do wonder though, um... There's another opossum. Make yourself at home. There's no events over okay. here? Yeah, there's no events. I know sometimes there is. Um, can I? Ooh, Chloe. Your doggy. That's awesome. Um, but yeah, uh, now... Do I even have that highlighted? Hold on. Okay, um... Yeah, we have to really list to it, it seems. I don't know why. I thought we already did that. But, I don't know, I guess it doesn't advance unless I finish it, maybe. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, got to remember to skip this part. Or maybe, um, I can just look around really quick. Yeah, see what's up. Oh, yeah, this is their, I guess their medical area. Wow, okay, so things are definitely, I think, is different now. From what I last remember. And yeah, I'm going to talk over uh, the overseer, by the way, because I think we already heard her, heard her like long enough. Well, yeah, I remember that there used to be, I think, some skeletons and bodies around here. I think. Well, yeah, now they cleaned up the place, I guess, because the, uh, maybe because of Heather. I don't know. Probably because of her, but we also got ourselves a vendor. Oh, what do you got? Uh, weapons. Got a tomahawk. Okay. Ooh, we can build one for ourselves too. It costs a lot of money. And then there's a single action, but well, that's for the grip. Improve recoil and hip fire accuracy. Yeah, a lot of cool stuff here. Even a stove. Hazmat suit. Okay, yeah, it is still standing. I am here. Okay, I just listened to that. But first contact is not updating. So I'm not really sure. <laughs> I'm actually not sure what to do. Like, I know how to initiate... I think I know how to initiate the responders here. Oh boy, is this part of the Bethesda bug? I don't know. Oh wait, there's also a stash box here. Oh, they want us to find this. Okay. Um... Yeah. Mutations we expected. But there's something else. A disease. I was attacked by Well, it used to be a person. But it had these green glowing lesions and its voice. Angry, tortured. We are one. One what? Whatever happened here is beyond anything we expected. And we expected a lot. Yeah, this is really uh freaking looking. They were wiped out. The survivors called themselves the responders. Looks like they were made of firefighters, police, emergency medical staff. They even have an automated system to teach people about treating water, food, survival. I'm doing their tests and you should too. I know it's even worse than we imagined, but Someone's got to know where the missile silos are, and how to secure them. The responders are the best lead we have. This is the Overseer, signing off. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at this recipe already that I found. Scorch Beast Mix Meat Stew. Like, dang, that was, that was pretty fast. Alright. So yeah, we got all this here. Got some throwing knives. Probably want to scrap these as well yeah gotta find myself a scrapping station i think there is one in um yeah in here uh can i get can i get this cake please no i cannot <laughs> all right 
Yeah, I think there was one in here that I can just quickly use to scrap some stuff. Um, yep, here it is. Just scrap. Even the, uh, you yeah, the pistol over here. Hey, compensator. Yeah, I can make myself some better stuff now. Okay, yeah, screw that knife. I got the Bowie knife now. Even though, uh, was it weaker? I don't know. Wait, I just want to scrap some stuff. I still didn't look up the... That one thing. The, um, the flare. And its use. Because I still imagine it's for, um... Yeah, I still imagine it's for the... Just to signal other players. Ooh. Right away. It's a dish rag. Alright, let's go and register as a volunteer, maybe. Or should I save that for the next one? And hey, you know what? I'll save that for the next one. Um, yeah, I guess the last things I'll do is just maybe explore around this place. Yeah, next episode will be dedicated to just, you know, joining the responders and all that. Ooh, cafeteria tray. Yeah. Maybe we should just uh, take this time to maybe set up a new camp. The thing is, you know, with these quests, at least I think for the Flatwoods... Um, I think this can go by pretty fast. Like, I would probably want to, um... Yeah, where would I even go? Because I think we're gonna go from here to Flatwoods to, uh... Alright, yeah, we gotta go to Morgantown, which I think is over here. So maybe I might have to fast travel using my camp to make things go faster. Or we can use the Golly Mine exit to quickly go there instead. Yeah, I think I'll do that instead. And then... Yeah, we do gotta, at some point, go down here, I think, right? Yeah, we gotta go down to this city, then make our way to the, the Ash Heap. Which, yeah, I'm looking forward to back to, like, going back to this place. And there's also this here, visit the purveyor to spend your legendary script. I am not sure what that's all about still. I did mention that, um, in the, uh, one of the previous episodes. But yeah, I guess uh, maybe we should. Yeah, we should probably just see how far down we can go here. Yeah, down over here. You know, maybe even build a camp. Ooh, right. It's also that bridge. I think that bridge. Uh, should I do that? Okay, maybe we'll not <laughs> go explore because that's gonna take up another big part of my time. Cause I plan to go there. Instead, yeah, we'll just explore Flatwoods. There we go. Let's open Chalk. Oh, here's the stash. Okay. Got some Birds magazines. And I, don't, I know there was also a camp over here. Okay, up there. There it is. Uh, what's up? I can maybe even start my own farm. I would like my to like make myself a Tito farm. Oh my gosh. It's got more rats around here. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we got some stuff for farming. I think fertilizer is We might need to do that, like use it to make some some crops if you want to. There's a shovel. We can equip the shovel. That's a weapon that I might want to break down then. <laughs> and yeah, of course, we can also collect some water. Um, right, there's also a camp here. Go investigate this place. Yep, there's a, got a feral there. Another feral there. Dude, I really love using the vats. <laughs> it's just so much fun. Some duct tape. Yeah, collect whatever I can. Um, huh. Rad X. Diluted. Gonna be very picky right now because I'm not near my camp. Ooh. Yeah, definitely Flatwoods is a great, like, starting place. I hear some gunshots. Got a carrot. Alright, what's up over here? Oh! Ooh. Got him. 
Uh, that's another enemy protectron over there. Yeah, wow, I'm dealing some damage. Dang. I remember back in the day, I would, like, not deal a lot of damage. Yeah, like when I first played, I like ran into a horde of these Protectrons. And it would take me a bit, like I, would, I need to throw a lot of grenades. <laughs> Had to hide behind some cover. Alright. But yeah, I think we're okay for now. And you know what? I think it is time for us to maybe upgrade ourselves. Oh, they were attacking some mole rats. Oh, shoot. Hey. There we go. <laughs> Alright, cool. Got that guy down. Yeah, I think we should also, like, try to give ourselves some armor. Because I know we don't have, like, a full set on us. Uh, that's just a leaf that fell. <laughs> Alright, yeah, let's keep on exploring around. Maybe try to find a workbench. Hey, there's a Brahmin. Alright, we can milk Brahmin, right? Ooh. Nice. I should have done that back at the Weird Souls. Yeah, that would have been cool to do. And yeah, over there is like the event. Where like, you got these Mr. Oh, yep, I think this is it. Again. Okay, yeah, we can do this mission for like the last thing for this um episode. Oh, we are getting thirsty. Um, I got some drinks on me. You just want to do this event. Uh, food and drink. Uh, we got a carry weight booster for 30 minutes. Wow. Okay. Uh, I guess um. Okay, what do I what do I do here? I am getting hungry. Eat all that spoiled stuff. And then some... I guess some ale. We got Nuka Cherry. Give us a cap. We got the Duchess Dram. Uh, uh, there we go. I got no new disease, right? We're still good with that? <laughs> I think so. Alright, so, um... Yeah, hold on. Where's the, uh... Where are they at? Oh, they're all over here? In this one area? I thought they used to be spread out. But no, they're actually, um, pretty close. I remember I had, I had to fight one at that gas station we were at. One of the red rockets. Yeah, I think, um, that was a thing. But no, they're all actually over here. Which is very interesting. There we go. And yeah, the supervisors, visors, I think, are the protectrons. Oh yeah. We're spotted. There we go, we got him. Okay, game is lagging a bit. There we go. Go on, reload, reload. All right, you go down. Nice. Um, search for Voltec agricultural. Something. Don't need to do that right now. Uh, let's go around. Oh, oh yeah. Ooh, one shot. Ooh, nice. Got a challenge done. Ooh, I think they spot me. Okay. Oh, 
All right, nice, nice, nice. Our score is going up. We also got ourselves a level up. Nice. Ooh, we're, we're now rank four. Got him. Dang. I'm just a gunslinger right now. Automated message. The forest watch detects all supervisors down. Good job. Responder team, proceed to the ag center and get to the mainframe. You need to reset the farmhand targeting parameters. Mm -hmm. That should keep our people safe in the area. Be careful. Alright. So yeah, now we can just go inside deal with the quest but I think there's also a thing with the overseer like a little side thing that we can do okay collected all of that okay uh, let's go inside and here we are do we have enough ammo though uh, let me see 27 we're getting short might want to start using other weapons this pipe pistol Okay, okay. And yeah, there's this thing here. We can listen to this as we battle. So. Here we go. Overseers. Let's call these personal journals. Not an official log, just something for me. My first post with Voltaire. I'm so excited. Oh boy. Feral. Oh shoot. Well yeah. Uh, in case you weren't able to hear her story. Pretty much, you know, she has a memory here as a child. That was pretty much it, you know, reminiscing of the old times when the world used to be, used to be not that bad. Now let's go ahead and change the thing. Here we go. Nice. Complete the events. And we leveled up, I think. Alright. And let me go ahead and claim. Wait, I think I just saw a bad guy. Cancel. <laughs> Ooh. Are we good? Yeah, we got a lot of guys in here. <laughs> um, yeah, I want to see... Ooh, we can also level up too. Let's go ahead and level up. Okay. Ooh. I want to see if I can get myself like another gladiator in a card pack. But yeah, we can do maybe a uh, perception maybe. Or I don't know, what else can we do? Can I um how's my agility right now? Can I do a a better gunslinger? No. Can I do a mysterious stranger? That will be fun, right? No. I think that's like way later on. How about this? I know there's also the tenderizer that I want. No. Okay, it looks like it's gonna have to be perception. Um, yeah, we do got one crack shot. So what I want is the crack shot and the concentrated fire. So, yeah, let's go and do that. Perception. And then, um... Yeah, wh which one do we want? Concentrated fire or crack shot? I mean, I would go for, uh, eh, probably this. Or no, actually, I do use vats a lot. Let me do this instead. Um, yeah. Uh, accept. Cool. Let's go ahead and take that out. Put the concentrated fire in. All right. 
So we should be able to do better in vats. And hopefully that's the case. We're in some toxic water. Raw fertilizer. Here we go. We got ourselves a lightweight arm over here. Oh, wait, hold on. This one's muffled. Oh, this is better, right? I mean, yeah, I think so. But we do get like an AP thing, like an AP bonus. If you stick with that. Alright, cool. Well, yeah, I believe that's pretty much everything that uh, you can do in here. I know we can just explore some rooms, but I just don't feel like it. Really want to get to doing some some of that. Yeah, some of that responder stuff. All right, guys. So there you have it. That is it for uh, this episode of Fallout 76. Um, yeah, next time uh, we'll join the responders. You know, see what's up with them. And um, all right, I don't think I even claimed uh, scoreboard stuff, right? Yeah, I was like over here. Demolisher mask. Got another lunchbox. Got man to man and all that. Yeah, I really want to get myself to uh, 25 here. I want to start interacting with some, some allies. I never got that far to even meet one. And you know, companions is probably my, my most missed feature from the previous games. Because yeah, you have to do everything by yourself. Not, there's no dog to help you out, no dog meat, no human companion to like travel with. Uh, that's a sad story going on over here with this Brahmin. <laughs> but uh, yeah, next time, um, you know, we'll join the responders, hopefully rank up with the score and get myself an ally. Even though I know they're not the same as companions, they're more like just settlers, I guess. I think that's what's that's what it is. But yeah, that's uh, pretty much it for now, guys. Ooh, yeah, I forgot I got myself that new Assaultron helmet. <laughs> that's really cool. Even got like a... some kind of sticker on the back of the helmet. I guess that's just to signify it's poly. But yeah, that's it for now, guys. That's game.